Hello, flippers. Hey, guys, can you hear us? We are your favorite hosts, Regberg. And now you can hear me. Alex Seabrook. I'm Regberg. Yeah. He's Cyberg. Cyberg. <laughs> and yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Another dev stream. Uh, we're super excited. Thanks to the release of uh, House Flipper VR today. Oh my god. Today. Yeah. That was really kind of hot day. Yeah. The VR team is super excited, by the way. And yeah, they've been waiting for a while for this. And uh, yeah. They, yeah, they made really great work. Yeah, we have actually we'll have uh, a special guest today. Uh, it's Chaiken, so he's the leader of the VR team. So guys, it's worth waiting for this. Yeah, definitely. yeah, and he's gonna let you know a bit more about uh, about the whole project, how it how it goes, because this is just the first release. Uh, we're gonna have a second release next month for the PC VR version of House Flipper VR. So that's gonna be another exciting moment and. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna have some interview with him, and uh, yeah, yeah, you'll be able to ask him some questions uh, and so on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, what's on the menu today? Uh, well, first of all, we have the House Flipper Signature Edition unboxing. Yeah. Uh, you can see you can see it on the screen right now. Uh, we also have uh, some uh, talk about the upcoming console update. Uh, we have the grand. HFVR release, which is the, the main uh, stream theme, the celebration. Uh, and we're going to talk a bit about the, the upcoming PC update. Uh, the lawnmower rework is actually a part of the, the, the upcoming PC update. Uh, we're also going to give away some uh, beta keys for the tenants, which is uh, another game we are publishing. Uh, so yeah, it's it's a big day, big day, big day. Yeah, I've heard a bit about the tunnels uh, on the previous streams. So yeah, yeah, and as always, guys, you can ask us questions in the chat, and yeah, of we're course. gonna we are here for you. Yeah, we're here for you. We're gonna try answering everything. Uh, if you have any questions, just let us know. We're gonna have like a little bit of a Q and A session at the end of the stream. We're also going to have uh, a a fan art uh, section. So yeah, that's that's going to be a pretty big stream. Like we've got a yeah, lot. Yeah, it was a while. Since the last yeah yeah stream, how so how long did, did we're ready stream? Wait, for this great adventure? When was the last stream? I don't remember. I like don't know. Three or two months ago. Something like this. Yeah, a long time no see, guys. Yeah, we struggled <laughs> a lot. We we'd like to make a lot of streams for you, but you know, guys, we are yeah. re really busy. Yeah, really busy. Uh, sometimes we just don't have anything exciting to talk about, so we're just waiting for the accumulation, and then boom, here we are. Uh, okay, so maybe yeah, let's just let's start with the yeah. with the signature edition. Uh, it's now available uh, for for a couple of days already. I don't know. You want to unbox it? Yeah, sure. Let's go. So uh, as you can see, it's pretty solid and big, and uh, we've been working for it uh, for a while. Uh, yeah. Shout out to Merge Games as well. Yeah. They are the guys who basically let us do this. Yeah, they are pretty cool. Thank you, Merge Games. Yeah, yeah. Shout out, shout uh, out for this uh, publishing. And what we got inside? Uh, it's a PS4 version. Uh, you've got here a lot of descriptions, like for one player, um, capacity, and so on and so on. Yep. And um, yeah, signature edition. It's uh, this is it. <laughs> Let's see what's inside. Oh. Oh. Can you help? Yeah. Ugh. See, it's so special, you actually need two people to open it. Okay, so here you have the certificate of ownership. I don't know, uh, wait, let me get closer to the camera. Uh, let's check it out. Yeah, with the number of the certificate. Yeah. Uh, here we've got uh, signatures of uh, main developers of House Flipper. Yep. Here's mine. Wh where's mine, though? <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, it's uh, completely unique. Uh, you've got your own number of certificate, and um, you can do whatever you want with this. Um. Yeah, so it's very unique because you have like a unique number, and it's not going to be like duplicated or something. Okay, what else do we have here? We have this amazing pen. It's it's like a I don't know. It's a more advanced pen for for some stuff. Yeah, like for architects. Okay, that's how it looks inside. I can yeah. Here we are. Here inside, uh, we got, uh, so you've got the the box version. Box this version. is, yeah. Hold it. This is the PS4 edition. Uh, inside, we just have a disc and and some some text. Easy. Text is always good. 
And uh, you've got uh, pins and uh, curing. Yeah, yeah. With so uh, house flipper uh, franchise and yeah. uh, like what we got here, like hammer. Yeah, the hammer. It's nice. It's just it's. And as I said, it's really solid. It's not just uh, plastic um, from pick your favorite country, uh, but uh, it's really solid metal and. Uh, Woo! That's it. I want it. I want it. Wait, hold on. <laughs> yeah, just use it. Yes. Uh. Okay. Okay, that's my house flipper pin. Yes, yeah, as, uh, as we said, uh, it's it will be probably available worldwide. Uh, so uh, yeah, to, to take it out and uh, take it out in the shop next to your house, <laughs> probably it will be there. <laughs> yeah. So that's it. That's we have it. the. We've got also signature editions for uh, Nintendo Switch yep. version, and uh, do we have more? No, no, no. It's just, uh, just, that's just all. yeah. Uh, so here we have this. Uh, so yeah, we can actually we're that past the <laughs> unboxing. Uh, let's go. So now. Uh, now we are moving to the next topic, and uh, it will be. Uh, consoles update, I guess. Yeah, consoles I update is a big thing. Uh, every time, I mean, you probably, lots of you actually see what's going on on our social media, like whatever we post, uh, whatever we put in there, there's like a ton of uh, console questions. So you guys usually ask about uh, the DLCs for consoles. Uh, we can talk about that later as well. Uh, but for now, let's let's just talk about the update, the upcoming yeah. update. Yeah, the oh, yeah, yeah. Re Revit uh, said that uh, we have to first put the intro, yeah, so he, he's the let's get it off. He's the, he's the boss. <laughs> When? <laughs> that was great. <laughs> yeah, okay, so uh, I guess Xibook is going to tell you more about this uh, this event, this update. Let's yeah, go. so guys, uh, since the release uh, date of consoles version, uh, we uh, the product evolved a lot. We had like uh, six updates on PS4 and uh, five updates on the Xbox. Uh, we did uh, our best to um, make uh, as many updates with uh, items as possible. Uh, but we finally decided to uh, equalize the PC version with consoles version. Uh, we struggled a bit with this because uh, uh, especially we had a big doubt uh, about code because um, uh, we fro we frozen the, the code like a year ago and uh, now we had to um, deal with uh, those differences between PC and consoles and uh, how to combine it together that our optimizations and their optimizations uh, will um, result into something uh, even better uh, than uh, those two versions. So all in all, uh, we spent like uh, three months uh, on this uh, equalization and right now we've got, uh, let's say, stable version uh, our testers right now, if you are on the chat, uh, yeah, cheers guys. Our testers on Xbox, uh, they are doing our their best uh, to test uh, this version and uh, they said to me that uh, it's pretty stable and pretty good. So uh, the update uh, is already live, but uh, not right now for you. Uh, we had to test it a bit more because we've got some artifacts still in, in some places and so on so on. Uh, so uh, in this month, 
uh, we'd like to uh, release this month or at, at the beginning of the next we'd like to release uh, the PC update but we'll be uh, talking about this later yeah and after that um, in September we'd like to release uh, consoles update it will be equalization update so the version on consoles the base game will be exactly the same as uh, the PC version after this update uh, yep. that is yep. coming after the upcoming update so uh, so uh, what we've provided uh, you you're going to have a better uh, tablet uh, better laptop uh, basically the whole UI revamp uh, you're going to uh, see better task lists with uh, uh, this um, quick um, with this quick possibility to get uh, the object that you uh, need uh, and this requ required uh, for uh, the quest um, so many many things that will uh, make your uh, gameplay uh, faster better uh, easier and uh, also uh, all items that uh, were missed during uh, game um, gamers update and uh, what was else and uh, moon update uh, so uh, like uh, tents uh, a lot of kids items and so on so on uh, they will be added to uh, consoles uh, also right now after this update you're gonna uh, say to uh, pc players yeah we are uh, exactly at the same level we're equal <laughs> we're equal now everyone is equal for us it's just uh, sure it's just the fact that uh updating consoles just is, is a bit more problematic so uh, there's much more effort and time put into uh, this process but yeah we finally we were finally getting somewhere with this and we're really happy to to make the uh, console versions uh, equal to the PC version uh, so yeah I, I guess that's that's pretty big news because we, we were getting so many requests from our console players uh, yeah, that's great because after that it's pretty promising uh, yeah. if we've got uh, equalized versions now the next updates uh, will be uh, possible for both platforms yeah, uh, exactly. at the same time and so now we are able to um, make uh, in parallel uh, those two, two platforms um, and update uh, them with the same content yeah so it's gonna be great uh it seems the future is bright. Yeah. <laughs> also about DLCs, uh, first thing first, we have to uh, make this update. After that, we're going to talk about DLCs uh, with you more. Uh, we're yeah. working right now on those, uh, on Garden and uh, HGTV, but uh, they're still a bit unstable, so we cannot uh, promise anything for you. Um, we, we can only say that uh, we are working on it right now. Uh, right now, our testers are working and uh, testing this, those DLCs, so it's real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So for sure. Yeah, this update is actually a big step towards uh, releasing the DLCs, and you know, without it, it uh, was impossible. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. Without this update, uh, DLCs wouldn't be possible. So, uh, yeah, big step, big step, guys. Uh, okay, I guess I guess that's great news. If you have any questions, just uh, please just ask and uh, we'll let us know in the yeah. chat, and we'll just answer those. Uh, so yeah, that was one big announcement, and I guess we can uh, proceed to the HFVR release. Uh, yeah, let's just let's just go. Come, let's go. Let's go. Okay, next topic.
what we've got now. Do 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 do. So, uh, this is our special guest. Uh, this is the guy. This is the guy. Uh, it's Chaiken. Uh, he's the leader of the VR development team. Uh, so you know, he's he's uh, he's the guy who's like. He's having his his big day today, I guess. <laughs> yeah, he's cool. behind this big project, and uh, yeah, he's the father of this project. So yeah, yeah, actually, you got any questions? That's your time. Uh, yeah, yeah. So uh, as we said, uh, you can ask Chaiken anything you want. Okay, hello guys. Say hi. Hello. <laughs> uh, it's me. <laughs> uh, okay, we can actually uh, proceed with some VR gameplay, and we're just gonna talk a bit about uh, the project and how it's evolved and and stuff like that. Uh, so, um. Yeah, let's just launch it. Okay, so this is some raw footage. Uh, and uh, okay, so so let's let's just start with stating what what version is this. Okay, so uh, we've actually uh, recorded it just today. Yeah. Uh, it's a Steam version of the game, as you see. Uh, there's a a dynamic lightning here. Uh, you can see you can uh, move stuff around, toss it around, uh, play with uh, items. Uh, I believe I'm gonna play with basketball right now. I, I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah, I found it here. <laughs> uh, so uh, the game, uh, the game is house flipper. So uh, the main goal is to uh, get get a job as a house renovator, get some money, uh, and buy your own house use the tools that we've unlocked so far and uh, yeah proceed with the game uh, um, you can you can you can do a bunch of stuff with uh, with with walls uh, as you can see you have a tool belt and uh, six different uh, different uh, tools there uh, so we we are very proud of this uh, feature here so as you can see you can uh, you can clean uh, dirt with uh, as uh, a cleaning spray and a brush. Uh, it's uh, it's pretty awesome, I would say. Yeah, and it's different from the Oculus Quest version because you are actually, you know, you can see what you're brushing on. Actually, like yeah. there are some improvements in in uh, in you know in cleaning and stuff. Yeah, it's also different to PC version because in PC version you can just uh, fade in uh, those. Uh, yeah, those. yeah, yeah. So when you're when you're cleaning on the PC version, it's just kind of fading here you can see exactly where you're where you're like brushing on the dirt so uh it's a bit more precise in this sense yeah and you can uh, you can do uh anything with the dirt you can uh, make a pattern uh, if you like we're gonna actually have uh, uh window dirt as well uh you don't uh, see it you won't see it on quest yet uh and yeah uh we have a bunch of uh, different uh, uh quests here here you, you need to cook uh, a chicken uh, in the oven. Yeah, you just simply place it. Everything is interactive here, so... Uh, yeah, yeah, this is actually pretty fun because you can like open everything up. You can, uh, for example, after assembling uh, a sink, uh, you can actually uh, like turn the water on. So this is something that you, you, you didn't see in House Flipper game yet. And, you know, it's quite awesome. Also, assembling is amazing in this game as well. At least I think so, but you're going to see it in, in a moment. Yeah, that's the next step of, of immersion. You know, guys, uh, in, <laughs> in, in, in House Sleeper, uh, you're just uh, assembling stuff on PC version, assembling stuff, uh, um, painting walls and so on. But uh, after those uh, orders, after those quests, uh, you're just saying the house, that's all. Uh, in this game, you can also... Um, just uh, play with those uh, items. Uh, yeah. Check what uh, wh what they can do. Uh, it's um, yeah, immersion is uh, here strong. I guess. Yeah, you can you can even what are the flowers? <laughs> yeah, it's here and here uh, uh, on the on the recording. I'm using a hammer to remove the mm, finishing coat from walls. Uh, and. You can see a skill tree here. I have I've upgraded the hammer so that it, it destroys more. Uh, it affects more uh, bigger area here. And I'm gonna just unlock here a, a special hammer, special feature here. You can actually toss uh, toss hammer around oh and yeah. it comes back to your hand. Uh, it's uh, yeah, those skills are are pretty handy. So I I think uh, 
I need to I need to mention that it's it's really it's really good to finish the job uh, 100% because you get more skill points and you can uh, and you can uh, do stuff like that. Uh, yeah, this is a fun feature. I used to I used to just play around with it. I call it the Tor Hammer. <laughs> yeah, actually, one of our testers suggested it. I, I think and and we we were like, yeah, let's make it happen and. Uh, yeah, we 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 made it happen in like uh, a couple of hours. We and then we we, we polished it for another like a month, I guess. <laughs> 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 okay. Yeah, yeah, and the skill tree especially is a very nice feature that you can like really see uh, the improvement of your skills. Especially, uh, you will see that later on, like uh, in in painting and stuff like that. It's really visible how you yeah, upgrade yeah. your skills and how they affect your. I uh, like the effectiveness of your tools, so uh, that's pretty huge. Probably many players ask themselves a question, because um, it's House Slipper franchise, but uh, it's House Slipper VR. Uh, in uh, what ways uh, this game is uh, similar to House Flipper on PC, and in what uh, it's uh, different? What are core features that are different in this game from uh, PC version? Okay, so... Uh you actually like the game premise is the same as you can see and uh, what's different let's uh, we 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 can't actually uh, move walls around but we can do a bunch of stuff with them we can uh, apply the finishing code and uh, paint them as uh, as much as we like uh, we have actually uh, a few fu fun items uh, in the in the shop so uh, the second difference is that we uh, we actually developed the game uh, so that you can experience not only the renovation but the uh, fun that comes uh, with VR. Uh, actually, here we have some uh, physics that you cannot see in the PC version. You can you can actually move stuff uh, around uh, small small items inside bigger items without uh, without. Uh, you know, dropping them. Dropping and, uh, them, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it just works. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it it disappears for a moment, but it's. Uh, I think it's a fun feature. <laughs> uh, actually, when you uh, and you can see here when you, when they drop, you can place them back uh, again. When you when you, uh, it's actually a yeah, so uh, house flipper PC version. So in the uh, end, thread, it just goes back if you try to yeah. place it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it resets. It's actually pretty cool. You're not placing it in like a weird way or something. Yeah, we we wanted the renovation to be fun and uh, interactive, fun and uh, and also easy, easy uh, in the way that you can you can make make mistakes and then uh, come back uh, with that f with that feature. You can come back to the previous version uh, and uh, yeah, here we have some trash picking. Uh, you can also see dirt here, like it's I guess it's a, it's sugar or or uh, something like that. So, uh, how many uh, hours of gameplay is uh, in this game? Actually, it depends uh, on your creativity, because uh, and also uh, on your um, on on uh, on the way you play the game. So, if you if you want to finish uh, every job one hundred percent, you'll have to spend uh, simply on jobs. You you can spend uh, several hours, like. Uh, it just depends if you play VR uh, on if you play VR uh, if you played VR before. I think it's between four hours to I don't know infinite hours if you if you just want to play around in jobs. For but it's, it's like infinite hours. four to six maybe maybe seven hours. Uh, I wouldn't say seven hours. It's like I think it's like five. But also you can uh, you can uh, buy uh, buy uh, houses uh, that are different price. And uh, yeah, they are not really that cheap, so you might have to do one job several times. Maybe you can grind in this game actually. And uh, there are many houses to buy. Uh, and uh, we wanted to make sure that uh, players uh, can play constantly. So you can you can uh, buy a house, renovate it, then sell it for profit, buy it again, and uh, do it all over again. Uh, you can you can uh, you can also complete jobs uh, uh, several times if you're not 
if you are not satisfied with the um, I don't know 80 percent of comple of completion, you can you can uh, start it all all over again or yeah. Mm, someone asked, uh, what about loading times? Ah, it's it's pre it's pretty short. Uh, actually, we uh, we. Uh, increase the loading time uh, between the scenes because it was like uh, half a second or one second and the loading screen is just uh, uh, it doesn't need to be three seconds but it's it's three seconds between the scenes and the first uh, the first uh, uh, the first uh, part of the game yeah when, uh, it's uh, on quest it's like uh, six seconds and on on pc it's less than uh, i think it's like up to 10 seconds maybe and the thing that i'm really glad is that we started to develop the game for android first so oculus quest is uh, on android actually uh, and uh, that means that we have no problems with performance we can also port the game uh, we we ported the game uh, easily in uh, uh regarding to performance and uh, yeah it's pretty it's pretty it's pretty great because you can have an affordable pc a regular pc and play this game with high fps like 70 80 uh, actually rift allows only 80 fps so you can experience that in this game uh, and in VR games, it's really, really important to. Oh, it's watering uh, the plant. It's watering the plant. Is it? Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm gonna water it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just put yeah. it in the sink and boom. It works as well. And in, in, in a job, it's uh, the uh, the mm, like the narrator says that you need to put the water in a cup and uh, water it. Yeah, it also works. But it w also works that way. Does it it's work in the real life uh, when you put the pants into the yeah, sink? Of course, I do it every course, day, bro. Yeah. <laughs> really? Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's cool. Uh, yeah, yeah. Actually, actually, uh, turning the sink on or whatever you call it, and like putting some water in your cup. It's just, I don't know why, but it's so satisfying in this game, like, the, the way, oh, this is the assembling part, and this is what I like about this game. Like, the assembling that you have, uh, like, a, like, a sheet uh, that contains the information about uh, how to assemble a certain object, and you just do it, you know, with your hands, like, literally. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's such a better experience, I yeah. think, and I like it so much, this system. It's, it's just great, uh, and you also mentioned that... Um, you created the game in a way that allows you for regular updates in the future. So uh, yeah, that's, that's another true. great thing about the development, I think. Yeah. Uh, we are actually gonna gonna uh, have a devlog about it, uh, partially about it. So mm -hmm. we made the game uh, pretty. Uh, uh, we can we can make content updates pretty easily. We add new item variants because we have uh, item variants like coloring of the variants uh, of the items and uh, we made the game so that we can post uh, an update every like i don't know uh, i'm not sure about the timing but we actually intend to make uh, make an update uh, uh, we don't want to promise anything <laughs> but it's going to be anything. regular but after 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 uh, yeah i i think i can say that uh, pretty uh, i'm pretty sure about the the date i think it will be maximum 4 months after the release but i i i aim at uh, oh, at, at 3 months and <laughs> We are gonna we are gonna read some comments and look for your suggestions for a new category maybe maybe an item lacks uh, oh yeah guys uh, don't item forget. variant so we can add it pretty easily for you yeah don't forget you guys are creating our games and it still works for House Flipper VR yeah, as well yeah. we're seriously uh, looking forward to uh, you know hearing from you about this game uh you know just just it's, it's just so much fun but i think with your opinions and feedback we can make it even more fun yeah, especially chai can can <laughs> you know guys just drop some ideas if we not uh, use it in this game we can use it in uh, on the yeah, others yeah exactly uh, still we are just following the community uh, your expectations your needs and uh, that's uh, the highest priority for us. Yeah, exactly. We've also actually done this uh, before because we made a contest on Discord before and we just made an item, a fun item just oh to play yeah, around Oh yeah, that's true, that's true. Actually, Katie said uh, to me before the stream, uh, let me just see this. There was a, uh, an item contest on Discord uh, for a House Flipper VR item. And uh, what suggestion won? 
Wait. I think confetti gun one. Yeah, the confetti gun. Yeah, I'm waiting for uh, it's for, the party uh, for gun. many more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty cool. See, uh, your suggestions are already in the game even before the game came out. So that's pretty sick. Yeah, and we are waiting for more complex suggestions as well. It's uh we actually heard a suggestion ab uh, that we could place an uh uh like an item that you can jump, jump on. Oh uh, the yeah. Trampo tra tra yeah, the trampoline. trampoline. Yeah, yeah. But we couldn't make it in VR. <laughs> Come on. But uh, every other item, I, I think it's gonna be. Oh yeah, actually, uh, regarding trampoline, we can uh, talk a bit about uh, like how the movement works because someone asked, asked, uh, does the game have smooth locomotion? So maybe you'll just uh, mm. tell us a bit more about the uh, the way you move around uh, in Hospital VR. Okay, so you have three modes, uh, three modes play areas in this game. The uh, most recommended one, the fav my favorite, it's uh, a room scale mode. You can move around with uh, teleport and also it's called snap turns with uh, joystick. You can just turn, uh, I think it's uh, 45 degrees or 30 degrees right left. Uh, we also have uh, sitting mode. So uh, there is a different brush for this mode so that you, you don't need to uh, extend your arm to uh, uh, and to also we uh, yeah yeah to reach dirts and stuff and mm -hmm. we also have uh, standing mode basic standing mode you can move around in uh, in your uh, uh, yeah it's it's like uh, it's like room scale mode but uh, uh, it's uh, the teleport is different you can you can actually teleport and rotate at the same time with the teleport you can see the arrow and so you're gonna be facing the direction of the arrow after the teleport. We don't actually have the uh, smooth uh, smooth movement, but I guess we can add it because uh, I think we can add it in the future. It's, uh, I don't think it's a problem uh, for us. Yeah, this is a fun thing when but you just take a paint can and just throw it at the wall. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah it's, That's uh, how you paint, guys. <laughs> Yeah, you can Don't move stuff home. like that. <laughs> it, it works li like in real life, right? Yeah, yeah. Don't try it at home, guys. Like with plants <laughs> in the sink, definitely. <laughs> yeah. But still, uh, yeah, th this uh, locomotion, how you move in VR is a uh, pretty common topic. Many p players are complaining about uh, one type of uh, moving around and uh, others like uh, the other types. Uh, it's... Uh, it depends on, on the people, on the on the player, but uh, the the safest one is uh, this one with uh, teleporting, and it's one one hundred percent. I'm sure that uh, you won't have uh, VR sickness uh, with this. Uh, with uh, smooth locomotion, it depends, and uh, you can just uh, have some problems. That's why we are just taking care of you. Yeah, exactly. But uh, I mean, the the Steam ver version uh, release it's uh, it's uh, a month from now, a month from now. So anything can happen. Yeah. You know. Yeah. And uh, also, also uh, the rocks. Quest version is uh, is al already live, but we're gonna post some updates. So so maybe yeah, you you can see it in the future on yeah, Quest as can, well. Yeah, you can also mm -hmm. check our uh, dev blogs uh, that we post on the. Uh, on the Steam uh, page of uh, House Flipper VR. So we just go to Steam, you, find, you look for House Flipper VR, uh, and you check the Steam Hub, and you've got some announcements that basically uh, describe what we're adding in the game, uh, what we're working on, and, and stuff like that. So this is another interesting thing, which is, you know, if you want to know more about the project, especially about the PC VR, Steam VR version, uh, you can just go check it out, uh, and it's some, some fun stuff. Definitely. Rivit, can you paste some links to a Quest uh, version uh, of uh, House Oh, yeah, it's, it's in the script. Oh, great. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. And, and uh, one more thing. Just don't miss it. If we are going to post an update on Quest, we're going to post the same update, uh, the same content update on uh, on uh, on Steam. So you don't need to worry about uh, these two versions not being uh, the same or uh, one version lacking one stuff and the other. Uh, we are learning, guys. <laughs> We're learning <laughs> equal We're versions. <laughs> we have That's actually <laughs> the same project, and it's, it has two branches, and uh, it's uh, it's yeah. The content updates are gonna be the same. Uh, actually, someone asked, "Would you please bring back the ability to put hanging TVs on the lindle? 
would you please add different color lightning that emits from the TV screen that we can use for ambient light? Oh my god, I don't know. Like, it, it's probably a question about regular house flipper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It uh, is, I think. Yeah, yeah, so uh, I don't know about this whole thing about hanging TVs. Like, what, what's, the, what's the issue here? I guess you can turn on a TV and there is a, like... A, yeah, there is the default uh, There is an ambient light, I think. I'm not sure about that. Can is I there an yeah. ambient light TV in the game? Here you go, the last one. Uh, to put TV on the... So different different colors <laughs> from the TV? I don't know. We never th thought about this, actually. I didn't know you guys like uh, ambient lights, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> I guess I guess we have uh, item variants on PC. Yeah. So y you could implement that way. Yeah, yeah. yeah that way. This one yeah. is possible. Uh, right now we yeah. don't have, but uh, for sure we can just yeah, add it's to it's possible. Our we just didn't write have it down. Kind of write it down. Yeah. <laughs> write it down. Yeah, it, you can see right now your ideas is put into our uh, sprint. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I'm letting our CEO know about that, this. <laughs> that's live. Uh, okay. So yeah, yeah. that's gonna be so possible. It's just we never had this kind of suggestion before. I think. Yeah. With about ambient, uh, uh, about uh, different of colors of ambient light. No one, no one thought of that before. So yeah, exactly. Let's do I mean, it's it's <laughs> cool. It's, cool. <laughs> it's nice. It's a it's a cool idea. Yeah. The tenants or oh yeah, we have a regular giveaway as always, guys. As always, on every stream we're having like a bit of a Q and A session, and we also have giveaways. Uh, so uh, yeah, we can actually start it. You can yeah. see you you will be able to see it in the chat. Uh, the only thing you have to do is just put it on the chat exclamation mark uh, frozen, and then you're gonna be in our raffle ones. Yeah, so, yeah. We'll pick uh, some lucky guy girl to have a house flipper and it depends on you you can choose house flipper regular on pc house flipper uh, equalized uh, in the future version uh, <laughs> on the consoles uh, xbox on ps4 uh, every everything is possible uh, choose. yeah you can choose any reward honestly <laughs> <laughs> okay okay exclamation mark Tenants. 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 So is this for the beta giveaway? Oh, oh, it's three. Uh, oh okay. Exclamation mark uh, tenants because. And you, you, you don't have to uh, know <laughs> anything else. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so yeah, just join our giveaway. It's exclamation mark tenants. Uh, but it's uh, for house flipper right now. Yeah, it's for house flipper. <laughs> Sorry for the... <laughs> a bit tricky. It's a bit tricky. It is. Uh, okay, so we can actually, uh, we have the giveaway going on, we can move to the next section. Maybe? Also, uh, m maybe if, uh, for the end, uh, can you say, uh, Taiken, what will be the price of House Flipper oh, yeah, that's uh, very important on thing. Steam? And also, what's the price on uh, Oculus Quest? Okay, <laughs> Yeah, let's I, go. Guess, I guess you can see that on the sides, but uh, Oculus uh, Quest version of the game, uh, it's fourteen ninety nine. it's live now, and... Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, that's it. For now... Uh, so it's equalized. Again. Yeah, Boom. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, we're going to talk about this a bit more uh, uh, this month. I mean, the next month, uh, you know, when, when House Flipper releases on Steam. Uh, we're going to talk a bit more about the price and about the release date. I mean, the release date, you already know, it's uh, the t uh, 24th of uh, September. So uh, if you're looking forward to this project, it's, it's, it's there. Oh yeah! Oh baby, baby girl, two on eight. It's your <laughs> lucky day. You're gonna have house flipper. Amazing. And uh, it depends on you. Just whisper to us uh, with uh, the uh, version you'd yeah, like to. Yeah, let have. us know. Uh, either if you're wait, did the people from YouTube also get the chance to? No. Oh, so if you want to take part in the giveaway, make sure you're on Twitch because uh, we cannot like do cross-platform uh, giveaways really. So, uh, so yeah, just make sure you're on Twitch, uh, you're watching us on Twitch, and yeah. So we announced the winner. Uh, let's, let's move on. Yeah, 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 let's go. Yeah, let's see it.
we're moving on to the next section. Love uh, mover like the hurricane. Yeah, so uh, the lawn mower update, uh, it's a, like a rework. Uh, I don't know how we called it in the, in the, in the, in the topics uh, list, but uh, it's basically a rework. So the story is that we released the lawn mower some time ago, of course, uh, and, you know, it was... Uh, it was it's a good tool but it could be made even better like much better uh, and the most important thing about this rework is that uh, we created some prototypes at first uh, so our designers uh, really tried to think of an idea on how to improve this uh, this tool uh, and we just did some prototypes and we asked the community uh, so there were some polls on Twitter and Facebook and you guys uh, told us that you really like this idea, uh, so we just well, we we just said okay, let's let's do this. And as you can see now, the lawnmower uh, completely ignores uh, collision of like the uh, objects in in your garden. Uh, so that's a big thing because uh, many of you actually said that it's really annoying when you're just you know you're mowing the lawn and then suddenly you're stopping on like a bigger flower or something. Uh, and it's just hard to operate it. Uh, so that's why our designers thought about this solution. And you know, we, we're gonna see how it, uh, how it flows, how it uh, just functions, but we feel that it's, it's a huge upgrade and I hope you guys will like it as well. Uh, so this, this rework, this update, uh, the lawnmower update is actually a part of the upcoming PC update. And the upcoming PC update is going to be, uh, is going to go live uh, somewhere this month so you know in the in the next couple of days uh, so yeah what else uh, so we thought about this uh, as uh, we just wanted to make it much easier we just wanted to make it as easy as uh, like cleaning the windows so there is nothing annoying in the way you just have to you know do the job and here is exactly that like n right now lawnmower is very functional uh, it can easily get rid of uh, like all the grass and stuff like that it's just we feel like it's much better. Maybe a bit less realistic, but... But come on. You know, uh, come in, on. <laughs> in Garden DLC, uh, you've got uh, those uh, contests, a uh, garden contest, that you can just pick the type of the garden, and then you have to um, meet the expectations uh, of, of the requirements. Uh, and uh, in those uh, competitions, you are creating really complex, uh, really great gardens, but also uh, this, this complexity of, of those uh, the lawnmower uh, struggled a lot with this. Uh, yeah. You had a lot of uh, small uh, pieces that uh, were just uh, co collided with lawnmower. And it was uh, very annoying. Yeah, a really annoying disaster uh, on <laughs> gamepad. That was uh, <laughs> even better was just to pick the brush cutter and to cut everything yeah, uh, exactly. with it, uh, not using the lawnmower. Uh, so all in all, uh, we've decided to uh, provide you this uh, solution, and I guess it's uh, it's pretty cool. Yeah, uh, finally you can uh, cut well, the whole grass from the whole um, with ease plot. And like it's uh, so easy, and it's still you know it's, it's possible. It yeah. still like requires some precision, but it's much more enjoyable. Yeah. Uh, so the game is uh, a simulation, right? But uh, we realized because of you guys that uh, you need to have fun with all the mechanics and it's not a simulation per se uh, it's not uh, realistic but it's it's fun now it's really fun now yeah yeah so uh by the way the blue color uh i know this from one of our designers the blue color is because uh the uh the contrast between green and blue is actually very natural to the eye because uh grass usually contrasts with the sky uh, you know, in, in a lot of, in many occasions, so that's why it feels more natural than other colors. So uh, that's something to add. And also, if you if you drive into uh, a uh, a wall now, it automatically gets you. It it doesn't slide on the wall. It automatically gets you like riding next to the wall. Uh, so it's another big upgrade that you will see in the upcoming House Flipper update for PC. Yeah, this blue color is also the symbolic way of uh, spirit connection between uh, the nature and uh, Whoa, the yeah. items. <laughs> you no, know, uh, you have to just figure out uh, what uh, the matter of this update is. The blue color because frozen district. Also, <laughs> it's frozen. It's frozen. And <laughs> district. <laughs> <laughs> wow. wow. <laughs>
Yeah, okay. yeah, let's go. Let's go. For let's pop the movie. Yeah. Yo, someone actually asked about uh, why not make this just a setting you can toggle. Uh, we're, we're talking about the lawnmower. Actually, Tofs asked it. Hi, Tofs. Uh, uh -huh. So, yeah, cool yeah. stuff on YouTube. Actually, making it a setting that we can toggle, yeah. I mean, I don't know if it might be possible, but we should discuss this with our designers and see uh, what they have to say. We'll see uh, if there will be enough feedback about... Uh, the ability to toggle this uh, this feature, then we'll probably, you know, think about implementing this. Uh, for now, we're just we're just we're just updating it, and we'll see. Yeah, the thing is, uh, we've made a survey uh, to ask you about if you like it or not. We're overwhelmed with uh, positive reactions. Yeah, I remember it, 90, 90 plus percent was, yeah, so was th positive. That's why we've decided, okay, so maybe we can just force it and uh, push it to, uh, to the next update without any toggles or something like this. Because uh, the majority of you decided that that's the right way. Yeah, it's a good change. I mean, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, as, as we're always saying, you guys create a game and if there's going to be a lot of feedback about like coming back to the old or more because you want it more realistic and stuff like that, we might actually make it a toggle option. You know, you know we still have got the previous versions, so th that's not the problem. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. It, it, it's still Downgrading there. is easy. <laughs> uh, okay, so now we can actually uh, talk about the... Uh, HF update, House Flipper update, the the upcoming one. Uh, I have like full patch notes here. I don't know if you want to hear them all. I guess I guess you do. Uh, basically, it's like bunch of new items, like doorbells, doors, mats, plants, and stuff like that. New cabinets, uh, new bicycles. These are actually pretty sick. These are like some mo mountain bikes. Uh, oh, and, uh, wait a minute, and it's uh, important that this update will be the same as update on consoles. Yeah. So uh, if Redberg is uh, mentioning something, uh, it means that uh, it will be uh, on consoles also. Next month, right? Ma next month, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So as you can see, uh, we've got this. Uh, we also have uh, the, uh, wait, new sizes for Persian rugs. We have new colors for wall wallpapers. Uh, what there? Oh, 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 oh! Uh, the new curtains may be drawn as well. Like I think we had some feedback on on our social media channels uh, to make drawing curtains possible. So there's that. Uh, also, the game is going to be a bit more optimized for uh, some uh, m lower memory graphics cards. So that's another big thing. Optimization is always a, a nice, uh, some nice stuff. Uh, you know, and a lot of fixes as well. We have uh, a brand new assault rifle in Apocalypse DLC. Uh, we also have some new content in the Garden DLC, and for AGTV we have just a couple of fixes. Oh, uh, a big thing in the gardens, as you've seen in the in the video, is that the patio, the patios, yeah, uh, can now be sold, and you can just set them up however you want. So that's 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 pretty nice. Uh, and yeah, yeah, the ghost reel, the ghost reel lawnmower is going to be probably the biggest change. Uh, so we're going to see about that. Yeah, and uh, uh, guys, remember about one thing, because I've seen on uh, Discord that uh, many times you're asking a question, okay, my game uh, doesn't work well because I've got low FPS, what should I do? Uh, the first thing you have to do on PCs, of course, is just go to the settings, graphics, and make it 
as slow as possible. Yeah. Then check your FPS, and then you can just make it higher and higher, and check when you've got when you reach uh, the FPS stable FPS that uh, suits you. And th that's that's the trick, because uh, we are uh, we we don't have in a house flipper any automation of. Um, uh, of the settings yeah of the settings that yeah. uh, fits your uh, your equipment so uh, all in all you're gonna have at the beginning always uh, let's say mediocre or the high um, setting uh, setup high, high, yeah, yeah. high setup so uh, that that's, that's the trick you have to just to put it to dollar the was the possible and then um, make it higher slowly in slow steps yeah uh, okay so uh, what's next on the menu Maybe the tenants, it's yeah. The time. Maybe it's the time to actually give away the tenant key. So, uh, how many keys, Redberg? We have twenty keys. Twenty keys? What? We have. That's many. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, uh, guys, maybe you remember or not our uh, one of our title, upcoming title, uh, the tenants. Uh, the tenants is uh, basically the landlord simulator. Yeah. Uh, you are uh, a landlord that's uh, buying a new uh, plot, new houses, new flats, and um, share those houses uh, with uh, tenants. Uh, and uh, yeah, you have to just manage their uh, life, their spaces, uh, buy a new one, uh, sell it and uh, growing fast uh, just to move to another um another i don't know yeah, location loca like locations uh, on the map and uh, going from uh, down to the to, to the top of the city and uh, being the, the biggest landlord uh. yeah uh, this trailer is only on this stream it's, it's not, not official, official yet uh, so everything for you guys ah <laughs> yeah uh, so yeah, so uh, right now the tenants is in the closed beta phase, which means only uh, people who are invited can actually test this. Uh, so if you if you're interested, we're actually doing a giveaway. You can win a key. We have twenty keys in total for this stream, uh, and yeah, you you just have the chance to to be in the closed beta for for a great game. That's it. All you have to do is just uh, take part in our raffle. Uh, you have to uh, put on chat exclamation mark tenants and then you're gonna have a chance to win one of those uh, 20 keys yeah so is the raffle on already yep. yep okay it's starting now good luck guys do you have any questions hold on let me check yes i remember the password now amazing that's cool that's <laughs> improvement <laughs> that's improvement Oh yeah, and remember that you have to be on Twitch to uh, take part in the raffle, in the giveaway. So, uh, so yeah. So sorry, we're kind of liking one platform over another. <laughs> it's not our fault, though. Uh, Do you have any questions or not? No, it seems like guys, Maggie didn't send me you? any questions. Come on. You always have questions. We know that. Hmm. <laughs> Oh yeah, so we we have one question from from before. Uh, so when consoles get the DLC with this change of the lawnmower? So yeah, we we talked about this already. Like the DLCs are coming after the big update, the uh, equalizing update for consoles. Uh, and yeah, we it's it's too hard to estimate right now when that's gonna be. We don't know. Yeah, yet. it depends on many things because uh, releasing uh, products on the consoles market. Uh, depends also on um, and others uh, release dates, uh, other titles yeah. uh, on the market. Uh, also, we have to keep in mind that uh, there will come Christmas and so on. Uh, there are many, many, many uh, things that can influence uh, this release date, but uh, it's just marketing stuff. Uh, yeah. I, I'm not talking about it. Uh, let's talk about development. Uh, we are right now in the middle, let's say, Mostly like seventy percent of uh, fourteen those DLCs uh, for consoles. Uh, so yeah, we are almost at the end of uh, this porting, but still we have to test it a lot, uh, which means that uh, it can take uh, months, I guess. Uh, I cannot say anything more because it's just estimating. 
It depends on uh, the bugs that will come. Yeah. Uh, you can just poke uh, Schwager uh, on Discord and ask him uh, more. <laughs> are there any bugs? <laughs> are there any <laughs> bugs? No. Are you testing it? <laughs> uh, is the game playable? Uh, he's the guy behind uh, those tests. Uh, so, yeah, probably he can uh, say more about it. Yeah, the, the only like 100% uh, sure info is that this console update that's coming next month is a big step toward actually releasing the DLCs. Uh, okay, we have a question about uh, like Steam Workshop update. So what's what's happening with the Steam Workshop? About Steam Workshop, um, okay. Um, <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Let's all calm down. <laughs> <laughs> Let's calm down, guys. Uh, my team is working on it. Uh, we've got a working prototype, but you've, you've heard about working prototypes so many times. Yep. Uh, but I have to uh, admit that uh, this time it's true. Because I've tested it like yesterday and it works. Um, we now have to uh, combine together uh, the tool to create a stuff for House Flipper and uh, the House Flipper. Because uh, creating uh, files, uh, it's not enough. We have to also uh, somehow import it to House Flipper. And it's the tricky part because we have to do this in, in runtime. Also, we have to publish in on workshop. Uh, so all in all, right now uh, we are in the middle of this implementation, but in the next months probably uh, we're gonna announce uh, some um, recruitment for uh, tests, for beta tests of uh, workshop. So s stay uh, calm and uh, stay tuned. Stay tuned and uh, wait for it. Yeah, follow our social media. Follow our social media. Okay. Uh, so we're picking the winners of the tenants giveaway. Yeah, let's go. Uh, by the way, if you if you win in the giveaway, uh, we're going to contact you tomorrow, and we'll send you a link to a Discord that is, you know, a secret Discord only for the testers. Do you wanna read those winners or not? Yeah, but if you win, just uh, drop us a message on Twitch. Oh, oh, oh. So. Uh, Okay, they have all the information in the chat. Okay, yeah, so you have all the information in the chat. Uh, yeah. Uh, you've pa pasted those uh, nicknames on the chat. Yeah. yeah, so you can see all the winners. Congrats, guys. Uh, Congratulations. Congratulations. Yeah, I've heard that Tenants is a pretty good game. Uh, uh, one of our testers really love it, uh, Overlus. He said a lot of good things about it. So definitely you have to, you have to check it out. Uh, after playing House Slipper, if you like House Slipper, you're gonna uh, love the tenants for sure. Yep. So, so what's next on the menu? Okay. Oh, so yeah. So mm. we have fan arts. We have Q and A. Uh, yeah, we're already answering questions anyway. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's the time for questions, and uh, we are here just to answer them. Yeah. Uh, let us know. Yeah, we we kind of have to go soon. No so so we have you. If you have any questions about uh, about VR, about consoles and Steam Workshop, or about about Richburg, about uh, me, <laughs> <laughs> just let me know. <laughs> yeah, okay. You can also ask us about our private stuff. Why not? Yeah, sure. Like <laughs> we can we can share some stuff. Like uh, if you're interested, if you're like interested in anything that happens in the company. Uh, or something, or how how you know how we function here. It's always nice to just talk about, uh, you know, our workflow and stuff like that. So yeah. Yeah, we also thought about uh, someday we're gonna have some stream with uh, tour the office. Yeah, we have to make a tour of yeah, the office. Yeah, we, we'd like to share with you our uh, rooms, uh, how we work. Uh, I, I don't know if you're gonna like it or not. Maybe just to share with us. Uh, some expressions uh, about this uh, idea but uh, we thought that uh, it could be pretty cool to, to, to show you how we work and yeah, our yeah. workplaces we have a question about how to review our oh uh, we we already answered this yeah we answered this yeah we also answered this yeah if if the loading yeah, screens are are got taking it. long right or something like that no, no, it's yeah, not yeah, a problem. Yeah. And uh, the locomotion thing, we we are thinking about it because someone brought it up and you as well. 
and uh, maybe we can implement it in, in the near future. I've, I love the idea uh, and I've, I'm gonna think about it. Uh, I guess I, yeah, we're gonna think about it definitely. Oh, someone asked, how did you spend the lockdown when not working? Uh, I mean, we were actually, all of us were working uh, from homes. So we never really stopped developing stuff and, and we yeah. We never stopped. So, <laughs> so we just took away all the PCs from here back to our homes and everybody was working. We have like some uh, stand-ups. So we basically uh, met over Discord uh, every single day to, you know, joke around to joke around <laughs> <laughs> and you know to let everyone know what uh, every single person is working on it was like some tough time but uh, you know we went through it uh, and we'll see how it goes in the future uh, yeah is there going to be more flowers plants bushes for garden DLC uh, yeah 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 wait let me tell you actually let me tell you what's what's in the new update for garden DLC hmm now uh, let me tell you yes <laughs> there are gonna be flower bed plants, uh, concrete slabs, concrete slabs, and pools. New pools. Oh, nice. Uh, and yeah, some changes. You may now spend a cozy evening next to a lit brazier in your garden. Okay, that's nice. Okay, so yeah, new content as well. But still, if you need uh, any more flowers. Just drop us your ideas about uh, species that you would like to uh, have in the game. Uh, also, uh, kind of uh, bushes that you want to have. Because uh, uh, those general uh, thing like, yeah, I'd like to have more flowers. It's cool. But still, we have to figure out what flowers do we need in our game because we've got a lot of them. Uh, if you will drop uh, the specific uh, kind of it, it's easier for us uh, but uh, if you need something in the game it's uh, everything is uh, possible to to reach but uh, it's we need time and uh, and time we need to, we need to work <laughs> <laughs> and to work <laughs> <laughs> okay guys uh so i think we can actually wrap it up and it kind of slowly uh we're still if you if you want to stay around uh, there's still going to be a fan art showcase that uh, Rivet, our stream director, pre prepared. Uh, so yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. I can, uh, yeah, I can read it out. Uh, oh, oh, that's hard. Reading oh, names. We can read one by one. Reading names can oh, be no. problematic sometimes. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm not on the right page. Okay, okay. You, d you guys do this. I, I don't want to do this. Uh, one by one. <laughs> <Okay>. Winners. <laughs> I I Alpha Q I I. Yeah. Okay. The next one. I am Poms. Yeah, that's right. Good I am job. Poms. I don't know what Poms is. Yeah. The third one is Scarboy one six nine six one one. Oh yeah. Nice. Oh, I got the easy ones. Uh, Air Rush, right? Air Air Rush. Yeah. Air Rush. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and also again, baby girl, uh, two one eight. <laughs> Good job. Okay, uh, shark is dancing. The guys. next one is Ant. Uh, how how do you call it? The Ant Man. Um, the floor, the floor sign. Ant Man uh, two seven one uh, two. The next one is uh, <laughs> why I've got uh, those really tricky ones. <laughs> uh, I told you. <laughs> I told you, dude. Bar Barva Guerrero Rage? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Let's say something like this. Magus 77NL. I got the easy one. Uh, ya yeah Boy Bronson. Oh, yes. Ya yeah Boy. My boy. <laughs> Margie, Margie, Margie 27. Time remaining. Nice. That's deep. That's deep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's about us. War Machine Gamers. Ooh. Oh, I remember this guy. Wait, uh, my taker. Uh, Boris two nine o three two o o two. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Niles Mer. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the cooking obler. <laughs> Lil Matthew one six five seven. Are you a rapper or something like this? <laughs> 
Liu yeah. Mafu. Log, Log Out Games. Log Out Games. And the last one? And the last one is uh, Buzzing Garama. What? Cheers. <laughs> Cheers, man. Cheers. Yeah. Congrats, okay. guys. <laughs> okay, we're out. We're out. We're out, right? Yeah. I okay. Guess that's it. So, guys, uh, thank you for a wonderful stream. Uh, we are always happy when we can share what we're doing here with you. And that was amazing. We really like to uh, share our time with you, yeah. meet you, uh, yeah. and yeah. yeah. I, I had so much fun. Uh, yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah, to do this. Uh, maybe a month from now, uh, when we release the Steam version of the yeah, House we're gonna, Flipper we're VR. gonna make another stream. Uh, easy. Oh, yeah. Maybe we're gonna play uh, some House so Flipper VR. Yeah, yeah, we we hope that you guys had some fun as well. Uh, we don't really know when the next stream is gonna be, but we'll let you know on our social media channels. Follow, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and you know, uh, follow us on Twitch yeah, as well. If you're gonna moan in about streams, please, most streams we really love, Rashberg, Yeah, Cibu. yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, please. Uh, then uh, those will be more frequently. Yeah, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. Uh, for now, <laughs> we would like to thank you once again. Uh, and uh, I guess yeah, see ya. Thank you for That's watching. So cool. Thank you. Bye. Happy flipping. Happy Bye. flipping. Happy flipping. Let's go.